In the hill in our level, it has 727 divine beings. Wow. Who can even condense themselves into more visible light form to be seen, if they want to be seen. Wow. But too bright to even see in a particular shape. In the beginning, you don't even see, you just see like a, a radiant overall form of brilliant light, you know, by thousands of them. Wow. They are the guardians of this plane, of the healing power plane, and the distributors regarding healing energy. Please continue watching to find out more. Supreme Master Ching Hai's lectures are not a complete meditation instruction. Please do not try alone. For free of charge guidance, please visit godsdirectcontact.org or contact any of our centers near you. Today's episode will be presented in English with subtitles in Arabic or Laksit, also known as Vietnamese, Bulgarian, Chinese, Czech, English, French, German, Hindi, Hungarian, Indonesian, Italian, Japanese, Korean, Malay, Mongolian, Persian, Polish, Portuguese, Punjabi, Romanian, Russian, Spanish, and Thai. Mamita 우려는 높고 아름답다는 뜻으로 한국 산수의 특징인 높은 산과 맑은 물을 잘 표현하고 있습니다. 한반도의 적추는 태백산맥으로 가장 웅장한 산인 백두산은 영적 구도심을 지닌 한국인들에게 신성한 장소로 여겨지고 있습니다. 신비로운 아름다움과 청정한 자연에 이끌려 수많은 순례자들과 관광객이 이 산을 방문하고 있습니다. 한국은 고요한 아침의 나라로 알려져 있습니다. 자랑스러운 문화와 전통을 지닌 한국은 옛것과 새것이 조화롭게 잘 어우러져 있습니다. 오랜 역사를 지닌 고궁과 신성한 사찰이 높은 고층 빌딩과 초현대적 건물들과 함께 공존하고 있습니다. 매혹적인 한국을 소개하게 돼 영광입니다. 신의 축복으로 순수한 기쁨과 웃음 가득한 날 되시길 빕니다. Chingai 그에게 평화가 있길 구루 나낙과 그의 많은 깨달은 스승들이 수행하신 법문입니다. 그녀는 우리가 늘 신을 기억하고 타인에게 헌신적으로 봉사하며 우주의 법칙을 지키면 인간으로서 가장 높은 잠재력에 도달하고 지구상에서 우리의 목적을 진정으로 이해할 거라 강조합니다. 
칭하이 무상사께서는 피난민, 노숙자, 자연재해희생자 및 구호가 필요한 분들께 정기적으로 물질적, 재정적 지원과 사랑을 전하시는 빛나는 자비의 모범입니다. 2006년 칭하이 무상사께서는 동양의 노벨평화상이라 불리는 구시평화상을 수상하셨으며 놀라운 자선활동과 인도주의적 활동으로 많은 상과 영예를 안았습니다. 아름다운 동물들을 대변하는 진실된 목소리로 그녀는 평화롭고 사랑이 담긴 채식을 홍보하고 인류가 생명의 신성함을 깨닫고 모두 비건 채식을 하는 평화롭고 영광스러운 세상이 오면 동물들과 인류가 행복한 조화 속에 살수 있다는 비전을 알리고 있습니다. 스승님께서는 다양한 방법으로 비건 채식을 확산하고 계십니다. 대안적인 삶 전담 배포, 국제적인 비건 채식 레스토랑 체인 러빙헌, 슈프림 마스터 TV뿐 아니라 정기적으로 영향력 있는 정부 및 미디어 지도자들에게 메시지를 전하고 기후변화에 관한 TV 회의에 참여하는 등 알려지지 않은 많은 일도 하고 계십니다. 스승님의 노력은 동물에게 친절한 생활 방식에 대하여 그리고 이 자비로운 방식이 어떻게 기후변화로부터 지구를 구하며 국가 간의 지속적인 평화를 가져올 수 있는지에 관한 전 세계적 인식 변화에 큰 영향을 미쳤습니다. 칭하이 무상사께서는 수년간 아메리카에서 아프리카, 유럽, 오세아니아로 전 세계를 방문하시며 다양한 영적 주제에 관해 대중과 제자들과 함께 수백 개의 강연과 담화를 가지셨습니다. 스승과 제자 사이에서 그녀의 통찰 있는 강연을 전하게 되어 영광입니다. 칭하이 무상사께서 여행하신 우주의 높은 세계들 6부 중 3부 2013년 6월 16일 미국 캘리포니아 LA에서 영어로 진행된 칭하이 무상사와 수프림 마스터 TV 직원과의 전화 회의입니다. Master, how many guardians are there in these regions and levels? Oh, uh, it depends. Uh, uh, mostly, I have written down somewhere. <laughs> uh, oh, man. How can this be? Oh, how many guardians? I didn't expect you ask. So, uh, <laughs> oh, it's, it's, it's probably a hundred something on wow. some level and more on the other level, okay? hundred seven something on one level, a uh, lower level, and a higher level, there will be more. But you see, everything is a replica. It's funny. It's amazing also. For example, uh, on the third level, We can also have peace, dream. There we can have love uh, produced by God and goddesses. And then you can have also like disaster, newly fine, but it's on the third level, for example, like that, okay? Yes. yes. And then yet, you thought that's okay, that's nice, wonderful, that's all there is. Now you go to the fourth level, you have exactly the same, just more powerful. And then you have to fifth level, it's the same. And then so a higher level, it's the same thing. Uh, of course, it changed a little bit. For example, on the lower level, you have like peace stream, okay? Yeah. And also, we will be bringing energy of peace into the world when I am like redistribute it through this uh, instrument of the body. But on a higher level, on the 37th level, for example, then you have a different name for it, like peace uh, manipulation. <laughs> ah, But it's also peace. It's just more powerful. Understand, Master. Master, is there anyone else who can go up to those levels? For example, could we ever also go up there? You? Yes, Master. Ah, welcome. <laughs> <laughs> 
try it. <laughs> as, long, as long as you are uh, willing to just sit for hours on end and wherever that might take you, even if you just come here today, you move next time to the next places and and you have to even sacrifice your time for meals and sleep and you have to even sit on the cold floor under the ground or above the roof or hanging yourself or in the middle air or something depends on where it's connected. The connection is not fixed always in one place. Uh, many places have this connection and it's not like uh, easy to find. Um, you can try to, to go astrally everywhere to look for it. And then you have to go physically there. It's better, of course. Number one, number two, and then you have to sacrifice many things. You can't think of anything else. You just have to devote your time for that. All your energy, just go into it so that you can absorb all this pure energy to redistribute into the world. And you have to endure discomfort or whatever the price for it. And you have to go higher first because uh, at the lower level, you cannot bear this energy. You will bust into powder. Oh. You can't even go near. You can't even go near. You're not even allowed to even know it. Uh, I told you already many places before that I've been there, but I was even concealed from it because it's not time to know. And maybe my level at that time was clouded by uh, too much bad karma from the disciple or too busy schedule or things like that. So even now I'm still discovering higher and higher level. It's not like <laughs> finished yet, huh? It's not finished. Yes, Master. Yeah. And um, first of all, you really have to be devoted. It just has to be in you. You can learn. You can learn devotion. You can learn passion. You have to do it with passion. You have to truly want it. And first of all, you have to go first above the fifth level. And you have to have time. <laughs> wow. Okay? Yes. Master, wow, it sounds rather very um, difficult. Master, may we ask how come you are able to go up there? Oh, I uh, just uh, remember that I placed them there. Oh. <laughs> I just remember that this is my storehouse. So in case I have to come back and need it. Well, it's just like, um, it's truly like that. Sometimes I, I have different centers and different houses and I'm sitting to check out what different center, what's going on and is there anything I should do there? And then I forgot some of the center or some of the houses that I have. <laughs> Too many. <laughs> and then later I come back to it and say, ah, how come, how come I, I forgot that? Yeah? Uh, like you have many things in your house and then, and then you forgot you have it. And then someday you suddenly discover you put it there. Yeah? <laughs> yes, Master. Wow, Master. This is, this is all so interesting to us. Master, when did you create those levels and place them? Since the beginning of time. <laughs> wow. Since the beginning of time, that means way before you came down as humans? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Way, 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 way before. Of course, uh, it's just that uh, these are tools and powers for the universal use. Just like in your house, you have uh, pliers, hammers, nails and stuff, yeah? Yes, master. Or you make it, yeah? You make it in your company or in your factory, okay? Yeah. Yes, master. Thank you, master. Oh, I just found it. In the healing power level, it has 727 divine beings. Wow. Who can even condense themselves into more visible light form to be seen if they want to be seen, wow. but too bright to even see in a particular shape. In the beginning, you don't even see, you just see like a, a radiant overall form of brilliant light, you know, by thousands of them. Wow. They are the guardians of this plane, of the healing power plane, and the distributors guarding healing energy. Wow. Master, so do they only appear, like condense themselves into the light form so that people can see or yeah 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 only up there only up there no they don't come down here they are charged with the responsibility to distribute like for example healing power into uh, the physical universe but only in a very minimal form and also depends on the karmic pattern of the people and the level of deserveness yeah? yes master so it's too small 
So if the master come up, can get more quantity, and then uh, <laughs> if power has even quantity to be measured, <laughs> we can say like that. It's easy to understand. More quantity, so that it can distribute more and pass them into the world. Yeah. I see. Yes, Thank you, Master. Hi. You're welcome, love. Hi, Master. Hi. It's an honor to talk to you today, Master. How are you? I'm fine, Master. Okay. <laughs> Is there anything I can do for you? Yes, um, Master. In the last conference, you mentioned that there was a level that you couldn't really tell us about. Your latest level that's even above the universal creating source. Is it possible to tell us about it now, Master? Is it the right time yeah. yet? Yeah. Not like I can't, but I didn't want you to get the wrong idea at that time. Uh, because I haven't been able to, to discover a higher level, and I didn't want you to have wrong idea. That level was, uh, it's called All Wishes Fulfilled, but it's on a lower level. Uh, the fourth, uh, no, on the, uh, I think on the tenth. It's just that, if you heard that name, you would rush me, Master, quickly then. <laughs> we wish that, we wish that, we wish this, and please do it, no wish, it, wish it all. It's, it's not that simple, okay? Mm. Oh, which will feel for me if I want anything? Wow. Yeah, anything I can get. And that's also a kind of like information. Okay, so now you go to the All Wishes Fulfill Center and they can give you whatever you wish. Small things like, okay, I wish uh, myself to be healthy, for example, like that. But I am the master, I can't just wish anything. Because whatever I wish is it's not just for me alone, it will be shared to the world anyway. And I don't wish much for myself anyway, number one. Number two, if I wish things for the world, I have to work for it. For example, okay, I want peace in the world more than anything else. Fine, you get it. Now you go to the peace, uh, <laughs> peace stream area and you sit there for hours and then you get that and then you give it to the world, for example. And that's like that. So like you go to the information center and they send you here, they send you there to get what you want. Hmm? Wow. wow. Yeah. So I didn't want you to get the wrong idea, but uh, it's okay now. I can tell you like that. Okay? Okay, yeah, Master. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. There's even places called Million Wishes Fulfilled. <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> but that was on the lower level, huh? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. You can see now why these connections are extremely guarded, extremely well guarded, so that any being don't wander there and, and misuse the power of it. Because if it's the individual, then you can wish what you want. It's just, uh, I'm the master, I'm responsible karmically and tangled with the whole world, so even if I wish, it's not like that to come out, okay? I understand, Master. Mm. If I wish for health, it's not like I'm going to be healthy instantly. <laughs> not like that. <laughs> if, if I'm not a master, yes. If I'm not a master, for example, and I go up there, I found it. Oh, I can wish anything I want, for sure. But of course, I don't wish for anything I want like that, okay? Yeah, I wish for peace in the world and people to stop killing each other and for animals not to suffer. But then again, because the big pattern of... Um, entangling karma together, so it's not like that. You see what I mean? Yes, Master. So you remember oh, sometimes in some fairy tale, it says that you meet a fairy somewhere, you behave well, and then you wish something, and the fairy granted you three wishes. Remember? Yes, yes. yes Master. Yeah, probably that fairy or that saint has been able to accept this uh, wish fulfilling region. Like millions of wish fulfilled. <laughs> wow. All wish fulfilled, things like that. Yes, yes Master. Mm. Okay, love. Um, Master, have you ever reached these levels in your past or previous lives? A smaller, yes, a lower level, but not the one that I have now. Wow. Oh. For example, repairing the universe level, I haven't reached that because we really need it. Master, how were you able to reach these levels this lifetime? Yeah, um, I told you because of intensive meditation. Because the, the world is in such a cow and the universe needs to be repaired now and then. Huh? understand, Master. The universe needs to be repaired. 
not just physical, but astral uh, as well, no? Otherwise, they affect each other. Yes, Master. Thank you, Master. You're welcome, love. Master, um, in the last conference, we asked if there's any way that Master can avoid suffering or taking on others' bad karma. Master, have you found a way yet? Ah, yes, but it's uh, not much uh, different. It's just a little higher level and more powerful. Oh, wow. But the thing is, okay, I found some. Um, that like uh, karmic immunity, yes? Wow. Yes. Yeah, as I told you, even from the third level, you can have this section. Oh. And then uh, from the fourth level, fifth level, sixth level, uh, mostly no, um, six, seven levels, they don't have this. It's certainly uh, from the third level, fourth level, fifth level, and then above a higher level, like nine level, upward. Not the seven, six, eight, I don't know, up to now I haven't seen it. So karmic immunity is that... If you found it uh, and you sit there and are absorbing this power, then you are immune from any karmic influence. Wow. For, for how long? You know, like for, for me, I've been able to do that maybe just for some days. Just days. <laughs> so my days are numbered. <laughs> you oh. see, um, then I found some higher region that's uh, more powerful, more karmic immunity power. It's just that uh, the words always change. Uh, for example, okay, some weeks ago, I have been able to clean myself of all karma for like 95 days. Yeah? Okay? And then, the next day, I, I'll be busy connecting with other regions, then my karmic immunity to go back almost zero again, because... <laughs> because uh, maybe new initiation... New disciple doing something bad or walk out or something, or the world, new born people. Yes, Master. And new killing, yes. Oh. New killing of billions of animals, new killing of each other or in the senseless war, competing for power and richness and all like that. Yes, Master. Senseless killing. Oh, so it's limited, Master. It's not limited. It could be limitless if I'm not connected with the world or with disciple. Oh. <laughs> if I'm just sitting in that place all the time, or more often, or often as possible, then I will be immune forever. I could even live forever oh. if I uh, am always connected with the place called control, life and death. Yeah? Oh, wow. You can die when you want or not want. Uh, but last time, when I sat there, I found it. I could live until at least the way I was sitting. I could, if I want, if I continue a few more days, I could live until, like, for example, 300 years old. And I was so, 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 so scared. <laughs> oh, Master. <laughs> I was thinking, you know, truly like that. If I, I live for 300 years, imagine, all of you are gone. Huh? <laughs> and then uh, what do I do? My bank will not recognize me anymore. My British embassy will not give me a passport anymore. They probably put me in jail for faking or oh. uh, put me in asylum, mental asylum for being cuckoo. Oh. Yeah. You could stay young forever. You could live forever, truly. In the fairy tale, it's, it's uh, sometimes told like that, but it's true like that. I have found in many regions, I don't have to go up to the 10 level even. Even oh. lower level, you can get that already. Oh. Wow. Nine, you know, yeah. And at four level also. But when you go up to the 10 or 11, 12, then you have more power. You could live even longer. Oh, so Master, is it like a fountain of youth where you're literally getting younger now? It's something like that. If oh. you have time to sit there. Oh. <laughs> wow. Yeah, but I don't have time for that. <laughs> and what more do I live long? When I've done my job, then I would like to be gone. <laughs> we would like Master to stay with us long and healthy. <laughs> yeah, fine, but you, will you stay with me 300 years? <laughs> for example, you can, see? Then I don't know anybody anymore. Suppose I live 300 years, all of you gone. All the monks and nuns gone. And I went back to see who, for example, they kicked me out of there. They would ask me for my ID card. <laughs> <laughs> you 
you know, for my initiation card. If I want to enter the Sihu headquarters, and if I want to visit my cave again, no, I'm not allowed. Oh. It's master's cave. <laughs> there, and everyone has to pay entrance fee to visit, uh, to make a tour of Sihu like a tourist. <laughs> yeah, nobody will not recognize me anymore. How am I going to prove who I am? <laughs> hmm? How am I going to prove to this mortal world that I am the one who will live up to 300 years old when my name is so-and-so? Oh, I see, Master. <laughs> yeah, when I when I sat there, I found it. I sat there for a while, I think, it, and then I realized that if I could live for 300 years, then what, what would I do? <laughs> kind of scary, you know? <laughs> yes, that's, that's a good point, Master. It's silly, but it's, it's scary, yeah. <laughs> So I just let it, whatever happened, happen. You know, I'm just worrying about peace in the world, the stability of the universe. Yes. And that the people have to change back to their uh, merciful nature. Oh. Things like that. Master, does the karmic immunity affect um, how much Master is able to help the world or the universe? For example, is the world helped less if you focus on the karmic immunity? It's, it's, uh, it has somehow, yes. Oh, it helps. Some, some percentage, yeah. Oh. So only when I need it, then I will take some of that to recover for a while. Oh, I see, Master. So that I can continue, okay? Yes, Master. It's just like this, okay? If you are sick, then you can't go to work, huh? Yes. Mm -hmm. and, and then you can stay home and feeling well and good and looked after and all that, but then the work is not done well when you are not in the office yeah. and when you're not available hmm, to do your job. So it's okay to uh, recover yourself and rest for a couple of days, for example, yeah, go back to work, that's what it is. Yes, Master. So Master, you can recover, but can you also avoid bad karma altogether? Well, at the moment, I don't think about that so much. I just uh, do what come, yeah? What come to me. If I need to, to recover for a while, then I will go to the karmic immunity system. If not, then I continue, huh? I see, Master. Sujungan 신의 사랑이 여러분을 감싸고 여러분 내면의 밝은 빛이 여러분 앞길을 인도하길 빕니다. May heavenly love surround you and the shining light within you guide your way. For more details, please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash bmd.